Uh, if you look at Contra Costa 20 years ago, raging urban sprawl, out of control uh, growth, uh, very little careful planning. Uh, things were like a wildfire in the, until the early 90s. And the political people were really just all about creating more and more housing uh, without thinking about proper planning, about creating communities. So we've moved a huge distance from those days. We now have urban limit lines around every city, a county urban limit line. We're rebuilding in the cities. We're building transit villages. We're doing infill. We're creating housing for all incomes, not just uh, middle class and upper class families. So all kinds of exciting things are happening. And if you look at uh, energy, for example, uh, Contra Costa is a leader not only in the Bay Area, but in, in, the, in the entire country in solar, school solar. You look at uh, DVC, Athenian, San Ramon School District, the Diablo School District, California Shakespeare, it goes on and on, major installations. And the Diablo School District is in fact putting in the largest school solar system in the entire country. So Contra Costa is a leader in that field. A lot of people talk in rhetoric and think of themselves as environmentalists, but a true environmentalist is by their acts, by what they do and the way they live. And that's exactly what this organization does. It brings it to the local level and helps people make the right choices, educates people and engages people to make the right choices.